Oh boy. Oh. Explore the creepy barn in the daytime, man. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> it's ghosts. It's beautiful. Eee. Oh, the chills. Oh, trap door. Yes. No, you should not. Ah. Oh God. <laughs> It was so, 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 so very scary. Into the mines. Oh my god. Yes! Oh, I would be crying and pooping my pants. Nobody knows. Pulverize. Gross. Oh, he has a lot of legs. Ah! <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. Whoa! <laughs> hmm? Oh! Boo? Oh, that was really close. Oh, no, no, no. Yes, 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 yes. Come on! Oh, cute! Or scary. Get out of there. Get out of there fast. No! Don't do it, Phoebe. Don't do it. Phoebe, don't do it. Oh. <laughs> ah! Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Tara and this is Tara Tunes In, my reaction channel where I watch your favorite movies for the first time. Today I am going to watch Ghostbusters Afterlife. I have watched the first two Ghostbuster movies now and they were both hilarious and amazing and I loved them. After I watched those, I got a bazillion requests to watch Ghostbusters Afterlife because it's apparently amazing. So I'm excited to throw it on and see what it's about. So if you're ready, I'm ready. Let's tune in. Ooh, it's chilling music. So I decided to skip over the 2016 Ghostbusters movie um, just because I didn't hear great things about it. And I had so many requests to watch this one. So I just went straight for this one because it seems like everybody really, really loves this one. Uh, so this is significantly uh, newer than the last Ghostbusters movie I saw. I'm kind of getting chills. I don't know why. Creepy, creepy music, I guess. Whoa. Holy smokes. It immediately looks so different from the original two movies. I wonder if the ghosts will be scarier in this one because they're probably more realistic. I am afraid of ghosts, so we will see. <laughs> I know in the first two, the ghosts were more like kind of funny and cartoonish and that was easier for me to handle. There was a ghost in the beginning of the very first movie. Uh, it was the old woman in the library and she scared the crap out of me. This is very intense right at the start. He's trying to get away. Whoa. Oh, it's the ghost trap. I'm really nervous about what's coming out of the corn. Oh no. Whatever he has planned. It's failing. What, 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 what are you getting? Oh. Classic. Oh no, it's here. Oh boy. It grabbed him just like it did with Dana in the chair. Did it kill him? Bad as the ghosts were in the first two movies, they really weren't killing people. They were just haunting and scaring people. Hmm. Uh, Mom, I'm trying to eat breakfast. Almost done. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> you made me bleed. You'll live. What are you doing? The neighbor's electricity is running out of phase. And you didn't think to ask me? I mean, you just demonstrates your aptitude for science. Uh -huh. Got it. You're better at other things. Quesadillas. Your quesadillas are excellent. Thank you. Look, I know I have not been a reliable or a consistent tenant. If you can just give me a week, I will be back with everything I owe. I can fix that! <laughs> I like her. Then I turned locks. Shoot. So they're moving. <laughs> Somerville. This is Somerville. This is where your grandfather lived. And died. Come on, not a single bar. There better be a bar. <laughs> there was a great earthquake. The sun became as black as cloth. The seas boiled. Whoa. The skies fell. It's a little alarming as your front gate message. You didn't tell us we inherited a murder house. <laughs> and just think, now all of this is ours. It needs a little work. Nice. <laughs> She's incredibly useful. This is so much worse than I thought it was gonna be. 
<laughs> it is pretty bad. I am thinking that their grandfather was one of the Ghostbusters, but I'm not sure which one. Oh boy. Earthquake, earthquake, earthquake. Remember that summer we died under a table? <laughs> <laughs> It's okay, at least we're only here for a week. How about that? What does that mean? It means we're staying. You said you had money saved up. Yeah, well, that was She's cool, she's money. so curious. She's gonna be good at this. Can I help you? Hmm. This was my father's place. Hi. 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 <laughs> I'm uh, Janine Melnitz. It's Janine! I was thinking, oh my God, is this Janine? And it is. Sorry for your loss. It's okay. I should be sorry for your loss. Yeah. Like a money manager? Oh, there was no money to manage. <laughs> could barely keep the power on. So he left us nothing? There is quite a bit of debt. Are you telling me this place is worthless? Aside from the sentimental value? <laughs> I love Janine. I can't believe we have to spend a summer in this heath. I sit alone and oh. He's fine with staying now. I'll be right back. Just took one second. Hey, maybe you will make a friend out here. Make them out of what? I'm serious. <laughs> a new home can be an opportunity to start fresh. Onions, one, no cheese. Lucky, there's, there's something wrong with the meat. Oh. Beat, what's wrong with the meat? Good <laughs> <laughs> place. I don't own it. I saw the sign out, out front. Help want it? Under experience, you put friendly with a smiley face. Not I don't really know what to put. How old are you? 17. Do you think you can put in a good word for me? I can tell them you have a pulse. My name's Trevor. My name is Trevor. Dude, that was great. Dude, that was really cute. <laughs> you really do. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, I'm afraid of that. I don't like ghosts. <laughs> oh my god. It's much easier to accept ghosts when they're just like funny, uh, bothersome cartoons. Ugh, you know what? Explore the creepy barn in the daytime, man. <sighs> it's the car. Ah. Well, that's not so bad. It just wants to play chess with her. Hey, Phoebs, at school today, don't be afraid to just start a conversation. Are you kidding me? You're literally setting her up for failure. How are the jokes coming along? Why should you never trust atoms? Because they make up everything. That's funny. No. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, be embarrassed. Yeah, fine. <laughs> He's also pretty honest. I like it. Hey, don't be yourself. You okay? Uh, yeah, first day. Can you imagine I they've got teaching summer school? Love Paul Rudd. I didn't realize he was in this. So sorry. Oh, and he's the best. Good <laughs> morning, class. How's everybody doing today? My name's Mr. Gruberson. I know, you don't want to be here. I don't want to be here either. But um, I found this gem in the teacher's lounge. It's called Cujo. Happy oh, my. Bernard. oh my god. Imagine Beethoven if he contracted rabies and just started mauling children. Oh my god, so awful. She sits alone, an outcast, rejected by her peers. <laughs> what a weird She's little guy. Perhaps she's on the run from herself. Actually, my grandfather died. So you're here to uncover the mystery of his death? It was natural causes. Are you sure it wasn't unnatural causes? Yes. It was unnatural. You're wrong. I'm Phoebe. I'm podcast. Why do people call you podcast? Oh, I call myself podcast because of my podcast. <laughs> I like podcast. He's charming. Yeah. Where about you staying? That old apocalyptic ranch off of 99. Dirt farmer had a family. Everyone says that. He spends every week working a piece of land, never seeding, never watering, never growing a ding dang thing. It's a curious behavior. That is curious. Oh my god. Oh my god, what a horrific movie to show students. Another earthquake? What is going on? What is this? Hello. <laughs> Hello. Is this a seismic map? Yes. Is You're that... a seismologist? That seems so hard to believe. Figured you for a football coach. Thank you. These are <laughs> tectonic or volcanic. This is a volcano. It builds and crests, but this is a tectonic earthquake. Notice a little P wave followed by a large S wave. Hmm. Like a heartbeat. This is the pattern in Somerville. Large P wave, small S wave. Where is it coming from? Hmm. I set up geophones, but I can't triangulate. 
Are you using three? Yeah, I know how many sides there are in a triangle. I just thought you were being obtuse. <laughs> Is that a geometry joke? I oh. loved it. <laughs> no, I loved it. I love her so much. She's the best. These two together are great. No fault lines is shaking on a daily basis. Mystery. Maybe it's the apocalypse. It's ghosts. You okay? Your lips are literally blue. Him. <laughs> you should borrow my hoodie. It's really masculine. Okay. Well, that's nice. I'm kind of surprised it fits me. Yeah, it's my boyfriend's actually. Oh. <laughs> Back to inventory. <laughs> Introduce yourself and tell me what you ate for breakfast. Phoebe, toast. Tell me a joke or something. What do you call a dead polar bear? Mm -hmm. Anything you want. It can't hear you now. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Oh, she made a friend. Movie theater. Oh yeah, that one's haunted. I don't believe in ghosts. Oh, that's about to change. You don't believe in spirits? No. I think we're all just kind of meat puppets. <laughs> There's something you need to see. Meat puppet? <laughs> Weird. We He's definitely gonna convince her that ghosts are real. The whole town was basically a mining operation. How would you make a steel beam out of an electroconductor like selenium? Right? Weird. <laughs> right? I like this kid. One by one, miners began leaping down the mine shaft to their death. They called it Shandarian Curse. Who built these? Depends who you believe. One day they just showed up without explanation. Hmm. Weird. <sighs> it's beautiful. So what's your podcast about? Mostly mysteries and the unknown. The occasional restaurant review. <laughs> Maybe I could check it out sometime. Really? Yeah. The show really finds its voice on episode 46. <laughs> okay. He's so excited to share it. Totally cool. Just do you want to be my lab partner? Yeah. Yeah, sure, I'd love to. Well, this is me. Are you recording me? Yeah, just in case your body's pulled apart into tiny pieces by an unseen dark force. <laughs> oh. Oh, God. Oh, right in front of her. Oh, I would move immediately. Oh gosh, where is it taking her? Wake up, mom, your child is following a ghost. Oh God, oh no, oh no, that's how grandpa died. Oh, trap door. It's a puzzle. She loves puzzles. I also love puzzles. That's the thing. It's a ghost catching machine and he was trying to save it or hide it or protect it. It's Chucky now! Or whatever that movie is. I've never seen that. Why is he showing these kids so many scary movies? No way! Killer replica! A replica of what? A trap. Oh, he knows exactly a what it is. Trap? How do you, of all people, not know about this? I'm ashamed. I was <laughs> I mean, there hasn't been a ghost sighting in 30 years. And why? Oh my god. This thing is real? Absolutely. Maybe. I found it in my living room. She lives on the dirt farm. Oh, the really spooky one? Yeah, the one that says dirt on it. <laughs> what happened in New York? The whole city was freaking out. And then these physicists showed up with these portable proton accelerators yes. and blew the roof off of Manhattan High Rise. Yes! There they are. I think uh, Egon is her grandpa. I mean, it still works. Should we open it? No, you should not. Oh my God. Oh my God, they're gonna open it. Oh my God. Oh. Don't open it. I wanted to do this. It's, it's gonna pop out. It's been in there for 30 years. Ah! Oh God. It was so, 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 so very scary. Where are you going? Into the mines. Yes! Yes! We should probably get out of here and libel. Yeah. Your grandfather was a Ghostbuster. Yeah. Somewhere. How does she not think that's cooler? <laughs> Sorry about your car. He is loving life, that kid. Whoa. Aztec Death Whistle. It's designed to ward off evil spirits. It's actually got a really horrifying sound. Oh. Oh. 
Uh, can I keep it? Yes, please. Just don't do that again. Hi. Hello again. Look, the truth is, is I've always kind of wondered what lurked inside this haunt box. The only thing lurking inside here is my slowly dying soul. Oh. Would you? Sure. Like? Yeah. <laughs> to her. I think Gruberson's trying to bone your mom. Yes. Wait, isn't this what we saw earlier? The Sumerians believed in a land of the dead within the bowels of the earth. The bowels of the earth. The dead are ruled by a mighty god, Gozer. The gatekeeper and keymaster must assume oh the my god. beasts. What did we let out? We're heading up the mountain. You coming? Oh, that's good. I'm glad they invited him. Rivers are like the moms of <sighs> That's really dangerous, I feel like. Why'd you bring me up here? <laughs> Entertainment value? What are you doing here in Somerville, anyway? We just got evicted, and the only thing that's left in our name is this creepy old farmhouse our grandfather left us in the middle of nowhere. Again, super honest. I'm not offended. Get out. Yeah, get out! What is that? It's Gozer. It's Gozer. It's Gozer. Oh, no. <laughs> this thing's ancient. You don't think this is incredible and bizarre and- I do. Can I have this? Yeah, sure. Weirdo. What about Phoebe? You think she'd want any of this? Oh, I'm sure Phoebe will find something. She found something, all right. A pole. Ooh, she's brave. Where the frig does that go? Oh, wow. Oh, cool. They're just like hers. Oh, it's a model. Hmm. Oh my goodness, what is she getting into here? Is the ghost Spangler teaching her how to do stuff? That would be so cool. I thought it was a scary bad ghost, but it might just be him because he's dead. That's less scary to me. How on earth did you build such a small cyclotron? You're a genius. Hmm? What kind of scientist was Grandpa? The kind that repels loved ones. She really, really hates her dad. But I love Spangler. We're having dinner with Gary. His name is Gary Gruberson. <laughs> date with Gary. Sure is. <laughs> Don't be yourself. <laughs> Whoa. How'd you know how to fix it? I kind of met my grandfather last night. He showed me what to do. Was he like howling and clanking chains? No. <laughs> that would be Let's weird. Whoa, boy. This be the moment of her death? Nobody knows. <laughs> Nobody knows. Oh man! Oh my god. That's so dangerous for a kid to be using. Did I hit it? He didn't hit it! He destroyed it! <laughs> hmm, what was that? Oh boy. Oh no. Is it Gozer or is it Egon, or is it something else? Oh my god, what's making that sound? And sliming everywhere. Is it Slimer? It's a ghost. Oh, not Slimer, but kind of similar. I'm not that scared of him. I can see him. And he's kind of cute. Oh, he has a lot of legs. What's that for? The plan. <laughs> Shot things out of his mouth at them. Holy crap. Oh my god. Get him! Get him! Get the trap! Oh, she didn't get him. He's kind of cute though. Don't hurt him. She's got him. She lassoed him. No, oh, you messed it up, kid. Turn it over. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, got away. Come on, darling. Uh, is he fixing it for him? What a good guy. Go for it. Oh, oh how fun would that be? Oh my god. 
Wow! Oh! Ouchie. That was pretty awesome. We need a ride. Get in the back. Sure. It sounds crazy, but Oklahoma never had earthquakes. Oh, geez, what happened? Oil and gas. That's what happened. She's, she doesn't yeah, care. <laughs> I just have uh, an allergy to science. She hates science. Science is, is, is pure. It's science is amazing. Absolute. At least uh, Phoebe turned out okay, right? I hope so. She's just an awkward, nerdy kid, but she's awesome. She is awesome. If you're interested in watching my full-length reactions, I invite you to head over to my Patreon page. There's lots of exclusive content over there, early access, I do a movie reaction journal over there, you can participate in polls, and even make special requests for reactions you want to see me do on my channel. So if you want to get more involved and help support the channel, then head over there and check it out. And if you want to just keep tuning in with me here on YouTube, then that is awesome and I am happy to have you here. Okay, so what the hell is going on? In the 1980s, New York City was attacked. The stories are real. And so are the guys who climbed a building and saved the world. Not to mention a 100-foot marshmallow man. Yeah. Yeah. Her grandfather was Egon Spangler. He was a Ghostbuster. All units. Apparently, you also called Dale get off. Muncher. 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 Cool. Muncher. He was cute, though. I like Muncher. He was just peeking out of those pipes like, Boo? Boo? Awesome. There. there he is. There he is. is He's that? so weird. He's just hungry. Uh, what do we do? Let's get him. What? Get him. <gasps> oh. <laughs> oh. He's cute till he's not cute. Get him. Almost. Almost. Causing a lot of destruction, just like her grandfather. Oh, oh, right. I forgot he can shoot them. <laughs> Flip through the date. Imagine looking outside on your date and seeing your kid go by in this vehicle with a gun. Oh, no. Come on, little RC trap! No, no, no! Open it! Ah. Oh, that was really close! Oh boy! Well, a lot of people just saw all that, so I guess everybody knows the ghosts are back. Oh, come on, come on, reel them in, reel them in! Yes, 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 yes! Yeah! Come on! Yeah! Breaks! Oh! Ooh. Oh, it's okay. Holy. What was that? I think we just caught a ghost. Definitely. Oh! <laughs> Oh no 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 no! What do we do? I say we fight. What? No. <laughs> Podcast. License and registration. We were on that big mountain, and all of a sudden, it just started shaking. I was there. Why is she in jail? Lucky. Quit messing with my inmates. Sorry, Dad. So ah, just okay. Waiting for my ride. You look good, Van Bars. Hey, don't we get a phone call? Who you gonna call? <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Do you experience feelings of dread in your basement or attic? Who's gonna pick up the phone, Janine? If the answer is yes, then don't wait another minute. Pick up your phone and call the professionals. <gasps> Yay! Raise a call, and we're closed. Wait, I only get one phone call. I'm in prison. Slammer, huh? I've been there myself. <laughs> I'm not a lawyer, but I'm listening. Are you Ray Stans, the Ghostbuster? And now I'm hanging up. Calling about Egon Spangler. Egon Spangler can rot in hell. Ah! <gasps> Why, Ray? Died last week. No kidding. Weren't you two friends? That was a long time ago. Oh, we could barely keep up our mortgage. We lost the firehouse. It's a Starbucks now. Well, what about Egon? Well, he wasn't helping. We went from 10 calls a week to one if we were lucky. Then Egon started to tell people that their little ghost problems didn't matter because the world was coming to an end. Hmm. Morning I go to work, he knew something. He cleaned us out. 
No, we were the dead ones. Well, don't you think he might have had a reason? Kept rambling on about the rising storm, huge psychic tornado that was gonna consume humanity in darkness forever. You don't understand. There's this mountain and it has these ancient carvings. Kids, there are a lot of mountains out there with ancient carvings. Take a little advice. Don't go chasing ghosts. Spangler was my grandfather. <gasps> no! Hey, hello? Helper, Ray. Come on. Sorry. What the hell were you thinking? Hey, Gary. You brought me He's trying to be so cool. We caught a ghost tonight, and there will be more. Okay, careful, well, you starting to sound like your lunatic grandfather. Stevie! Oh, 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 that's a bad idea. Spend the night, my Joe. You can, you can keep it. Go. No. Yeah, that was a bad idea. I'm sorry the night went sideways. Are you kidding me? We had Kung Pao shrimp. We went to jail. I mean, I don't know how we're going to top this. This is a home run. I like him. It's you don't want to. I'd need to clean. We're barely hanging on here. You don't understand. We drove around town destroying expensive property. But saving them for... from the munchy ghost. I think he was a sad old man who turned his back on his family. Where, by the way, everybody thought he was nuts. He was special. He loved science like me. Why didn't you tell me my grandfather was Egon Spangler? I'm glad you found yourself here. I really am. But all I see are reminders that I didn't mean a thing to him. Yeah, but I think he did all that for a reason. He was probably trying to save them because he loved them. Oh God, oh no. The beasts are coming and everything. Oh God. Oh no, oh no. Not the marshmallows. Oh my God, cute. Or scary. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> wow. Hello. Boop. <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah. I was wondering if he's going to be evil. Oh my god, every marshmallow. Oh my god, this is going to be bad. Oh god. Yeah, oh god. Oh, that's pretty morbid. Oh, watch out, guys. Why is he so happy? This is so bizarre. Get out of there. Get out of there fast. No, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh my god, run! Ah! Get in your car, get in your car, get in your car. Oh yeah, your car doesn't have a windshield. It doesn't matter anyway, you're done for. He's gonna be the key master. Gozer was a Sumerian god who once walked amongst the living. Soul-eating flame yeah. of the deity of evil. And I think it wants back. Evo Shandor, he built this whole town. In New York, he created an apartment building made out of selenium girders. On that same rooftop is where our grandfather fought to keep a horde of ghosts from entering our dimension. Oh. Going into the mine. It's the only way. Oh my god. Yeah, we're entering the depths of hell here. That's her. Gozer's Creepy voice and all. If this is a tomb, where are all the bodies? Oh Found one! God. Who is that? Is he sleeping? Wow. Wow. He's been in here for so Oh, years. it's Evo Shandor. I think these are years. 1883? The Krakatoa eruption. What happened in 1908? Probably the Tunguska blast over Siberia. Wow. Podcast knows a lot. 1984. Ghosts attack New York City. I yep. It's a countdown. Uh, like a prophecy? Did you guys hear that? Uh, I don't think they're safe. I think it's coming from the death pit. Oh my god, is she coming? <sighs> she was so creepy the first time. Vivi, get back! What the heck? Vivi, get out of the way, man. <gasps> oh my god! No! Don't do it, Phoebe, don't do it! Oh my god. 
So this is causing the earthquakes, but what is going on? I think he's alive. He was right all along. He was right here. He built this. He was standing guard even when no one believed him. He was just protecting his family. That's what I thought. He built that thing to keep all those ghosts in the ghost pit. Talk to your daughter, Egon. Yes. He's got something to show her. A picture? Aww. Aww. He loved her so much. Aww. Uh-oh. Is that the bad ghost? <laughs> Oh my gosh, she's gonna be okay. No, oh God, oh no, oh no, she's gonna be the gatekeeper. Oh shoot. Mom? Oh gosh, she's gonna be scary. She's gonna be really scary. Mom, are you okay? Oh, this this is creepy. I don't think I'm gonna like this. Oh God. Ew. Mom. Stay away from her, stay away from her, stay away from her. Mom, Phoebe, what would you stop? Whoa. Egon's trying to tell them she's dangerous. Oh, he's breaking it. Oh, here they come. He was keeping all the ghosts at bay, and now they're free. Oh no, here they go. Oh no, here they go. Oh my god. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, he had a plan. This isn't a farm. It's a trap. It's a big trap. Yes. This is what he's been working on all those years. These big silos act as a capacitor. Whoa. These towers can hold a charge for one moment, but in that one moment, they can power hundreds of traps. How do we get Gozer into the field? Keymaster and the Gatekeeper. She needs both of them. But first, these spirits must possess two human souls so they can unite formally. Hmm. We're thinking at least third base. <laughs> He's got a little flower in his hair. I like to watch. Hello. Hello, my mother. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> there they go. What are you doing? I have a plan. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna munch right through the metal. He's very hungry. Harmless. He just eats metal. Bye! Come on, let's go. I love that it's a bunch of kids this time who are kind of saving the day. That's my mom. Not anymore. Oh god. Oh, here she is. She looks creepy. Your eminence. Whoa, a leg. Goddess of gods. I have built this temple for you so that you might return to Earth and together. <laughs> Gross, he's an old miner. <gasps> oh. Excuse me. Brave. What do you call a fish with no eyes? A fish. <laughs> a whale. There's Good job. Bar, and one of them goes, oh. And then the other one goes, go home, you're drunk. <laughs> She's doing great. Keep on going. Just distract her. Have you come to offer yourself in sacrifice? No. Can they get her? Can they put her in the box? I need a status report. Did they get her and put her in the box or what? Wait, wh what's going on? It's okay. You're kind of possessed. Phoebe, there's this basement, the secret basement. Oh, we know. Isn't that place in Super News? We really want to hear about it. Yeah, but we're kind of trying to save the, the Super right News. Oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Boyfriend Gary. Boyfriend? <laughs> 
if the gatekeeper and the keymaster reunite. Oh, I see. They just took one so that Gozer couldn't function. Phoebe, you. I'm a scientist. <laughs> That's cute. She's a badass, is what she is. This was Grandpa's plan. Holy smokes. Oh, my goodness. Come on, get in the dirt. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Cool. Oh no, these little crappers. No, 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 how? Hit the pedal! Hit the pedal! Hit the pedal! Wow! Yes, 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 yes! Oh no, 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 no! <gasps> Gary! Oh no, this went wrong. This went wrong. This went wrong. <gasps> oh no! It's a new gatekeeper! Come on! Egon! Egon, do something! No, 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 yeah. Are you a god? Remember, Ray? Ray? Oh, come on, Ray. Remember? Yes. Yes. Yeah, we're all gods. Yeah, I mean, we're all pretty dang special down here. On a personal note, I thought that we had busted up for good. OK, playtime's over. Let's toast this muffin. Toaster. Light him up. Man, I love that sound. On the count of three, go on two, one. Come on. I love it, 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 I love it. Cross the streams, fellas! Yeah! Well, how can she do that? No! I don't remember this job being so painful. <laughs> I do. There are no spring chickens anymore. You got a lot of nerve coming back here, crawling back <laughs> to me. We could have been the most spectacular power couple. Oh, well, who's had to maim somebody? <laughs> that was the whole plan. <gasps> Get her. Come on, Phoebe. <gasps> yeah. Oh. Hmm. They needed all four of them. in the world, including Ego? Oh no, he's okay. That's a nice moment. I thought you might turn up. Hmm? I'm sorry, I didn't believe you. Good old Canadian sorry in there. I'm sorry. I should have called. A mission, my friend. That's nice. Hi there, Pete Venkman from the home office. Hey Thanks Pete. I like your style. <laughs> Who's that one? Don't even think about it, Pete. Spangler. <laughs> Weird name. Try to make the best of that. <laughs> All right. We're going to have Coco inside. Yeah. Oh, it's scary. <laughs> hey, man. <Are> you okay? <gasps> he looks crazy. I totally thought I lost you. Sorry about that. <laughs> Why am I bleeding? Um, you had butted a park bench. Oh. <laughs> okay. You had a blast. Zapping all those guys. You just single-handedly defeated a manifestation of Gozer. You gotta be my podcast. Sure, what's it called? Mystical Tales of the Unknown Universe. NTW, <laughs> that's you. You're my subscriber? Really found its voice in the 46th episode. Yeah, Thank that's you. what he Do said. It. Don't worry, I'll take you home, get you all cleaned up. <laughs> Aww.
No, sad. Tell me what this is. Is that what? Dana? It's Dana. Dana and Peter. Are they still together? Yeah. <laughs> Let's try this one. It's a five pointed star. <laughs> did you mark the cards? <laughs> no. You did, didn't you? He did. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he deserves it. <laughs> I want you to take this. It's my lucky coin. We might not be coming back. Egon was brains. Ray was the heart. Peter just kept it cool. Mm -hmm. Who are you? A sex appeal. <laughs> <laughs> You've done very well for yourself. I remember the day you came in. Busting ghosts with the guys taught me not to be afraid. Yeah. But I had the tools and I had the talent. And I will always be a ghostbuster. Yeah. Nice. Oh, oh. Okay guys, that was Ghostbusters Afterlife. And it was so, so, so good. I loved it. I loved that kids were now the Ghostbusters for a good portion of this movie. And then I loved how at the end they brought back the OG original Ghostbusters to save the day and help out. And I loved that Egon came back as a ghost to help because they needed all four of them to vanquish Gozer and save everyone. It was really sentimental and special. I love that Janine was there, all the original cast except for Harold Ramis who has passed, which really made that last scene where he's a ghost and he's saying goodbye a little bit more meaningful, a little bit more touching because I think that the original cast members probably felt kind of sad coming together without him there. So that was really cool to see. And what a fun movie. I really loved Phoebe. I thought she was really cool. She was just this cool kid who was awkward and uncomfortable and told jokes when she was nervous but she ended up being so badass and so cool and just loving science and being good at it and saving the day. I loved all the characters in this. The brother was great, his little girlfriend was great, and I really loved the mom and the teacher. Also, Gary was super funny. I'm a pretty big fan of Paul Rudd. I just find his comedy really endearing and adorable and funny, so he was a great addition to the cast as well. I thought it was cool how they kind of revealed slowly that her grandpa was a ghostbuster and they were able to learn about all the great stuff the Ghostbusters did back in the day, so that was pretty awesome. I love that they brought back Gozer and the two dogs and kind of the same idea again, because it just felt really nostalgic and cool to do it that way. Even the little Stay Puffed guys were around. They were really cute but also really scary in numbers. Thanks so much guys for suggesting that I watch this one after Ghostbusters and Ghostbusters 2. I really enjoyed going back into the world of Ghostbusters and revisiting everything. It was really fun. If you liked the video, please hit like and please subscribe to my channel and uh, come on over to my Patreon page if you want to get a little bit more involved as well. Thanks again for being here and I will see you all next time. Bye. If you're wondering what the crazy sound is, it's my neighbor snow blowing just outside the window. Uh, I stopped the movie because this is the, I clicked on the wrong movie. So, scratch all that, scratch all that, scratch all that.